Is this- wait. Is this supposed to be the remaster for the first Last of Us game? Why does it look like this? Which- which one is the better looking one? Which one is the new one? Apparently the bottom one is the remaster. But the top one looks better. Like, obviously. This is from the same cutscene? Why'd they make the lighting less interesting? Why- why the- why is the texture here make everything look muddy? It's so weird. Okay, I, I need to explain this to you guys, okay? And I'm objectively right, and if you disagree with this, then I don't care if you live or die. Um, your, your life is meaningless to me, okay? Game dev resources should not be spent remastering games that are so new that they look like this. That is insane, okay? The only thing that they need to care about is making sure that these games are playable. As in making sure that like you can like 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 release like at one third cost like yeah here now it plays on the PS5 that's it um, the the remakes are done so they can justify charging people more for a product that is at best the same and at worst worse than the original you know there is no reason to do a remake of a game unless that remake can substantively change the playing experience. Uh, which is why I don't agree with the um, Resident Evil 4 remake, because Resident Evil 4 is already fine and perfect and plays perfect. Resident Evil 1, 2, and 3 obviously benefited massively from the remake, because those ga the remakes are like totally different. Yeah, like that's fine, you know? If a remake changes the game and adds artistically to the original, then that's fine. Bloodborne? The only thing they need to do for Bloodborne is put it on the PC, and make it 60 FPS. That's it. That's a port. That's, a, that's not a remake. You know? That's it. That's all I want. And make it brighter. You can make it brighter in the settings if you want. That's it. Just make it on the PC. I kind of disagree with this. A remake brings it back in the mainstream discussion. No, 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 no. Don't. Stop. Don't give permission to AAA studios to jerk off in their money pit forever constantly re-releasing and tweaking the same game for a decade like the game is out if people want to play it play it in its original state there's something really fucked up it's like the bible where they keep remaking it you know like there's something really fucked up about the fact that for some of these games nobody even knows what the original was it's like it's not even an original product anymore it's just like this ongoing like perma update shit that, that, like, it, and nobody even knows what anyone's talking about anymore. That shit really bothers me, you know? Um, I would care about Skyrim, but it's a bad game anyway, so I don't really care, you know? Do you think remasters are better than remakes? I will almost always prefer a remaster to a remake. I fucking love it when they're like, yeah, we're literally just going to make the exact same game, we're just going to fix some bugs, make it playable on modern systems, and we're going to hit a button that you can press to update the textures and, and, and resolution. And that's it. I love that shit. Um, the Grim Fandango remaster was really, really good. I love, I love it when they do shit like this, man. Oh yeah, wait, the StarCraft remaster. Oh, the StarCraft. Oh, the StarCraft remaster. Oh my God. What a, what a brilliant, let me get a good picture. I need a nice HD picture. That's not HD. No, we need an HD picture. Yeah, give me a, give me a grande. Thank you. This is what I'm talking about right here. Okay. You can literally hit a button to switch between the two. The StarCraft remaster literally did nothing other than um, update the resolution, make it playable on modern systems, and make all the models, like, higher fidelity. That's it. The art style, exactly the same. The gameplay, exactly the same. The lighting, well, the lighting, it's its a 2D game, basically, so it's not even really lighting. That's not even, like... But it, it's exactly the same. Uh, Diablo 2. Diablo 2 is the same thing. Though now they're changing the new Diablo 2. So now it's not the same. Yeah, the Halo games did that as well. I like it when they do stuff like that. Yeah, the Halo Master Chief Collection. I like it when they do stuff like that. Um, like, if people want to play it in, like... so Like, because this way, 
you give people what they want. If you want to play the game in super modern um, fancy mode, hit a button. And if you want to play literally just the old game, but with modern frame rate resolution, just hit, look at this, you know? Canvan, I'm okay with remakes as long as they're adding to, like, the artistic value of the original product. You know? They're not doing that with The Last of Us Part 1. They're not. Like, it's the, sa it's the same shit. What do you think about the KOTOR remake? I, I, I don't know. I haven't, I haven't played it. Um, yeah. The StarCraft 1, um, the StarCraft 1 remaster was so, so, so good. Um... So the Demon Souls remake is okay. Well, the 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 Demon Souls remake was practically a remaster, wasn't it? The Demon Souls, it was basically just a graphical update. Like they changed a lot of graphical stuff, but the game was fundamentally the same, right? Now remake, I don't know what they changed. It was a remake. They had to do it from the ground up. Okay, but in terms of the. They re uh, reused old AI code. Okay, so it was basically like a full graphical remake. I would argue that the difference between Demon Souls 1 and, and like the Demon Souls remake was probably significant enough that you could make a better argument for its change, you know? Like, when I look at this, this is like a joke. Like, wow, really? You know? Okay. But then like, Demon Souls remake comparison. Um, but I, I've seen what the original Demon Souls looks like, and wow, you know, I don't know. I, I feel like you can make a better argument for that. Um, graphics have come a long, a long way in that time. Um, but yeah, I don't know. You can, you could you could argue like maybe. I think I think there's also you can also argue um, because Demon Souls is like the red, it's like the youngest from software game that people talk about in the Soul series, like effectively. If you don't want to go back to Kingsfield but a lot of people haven't played it because it was much smaller back then. That really is re-releasing it to a new audience, but, like, everyone knows about The Last of Us Part 1, right? You know? I don't know. I don't know. You know, whatever. I Corporate, corporate needs you to identify a difference between these four pictures. Difference between remake and remaster? Um, it gets kind of blurry. Um, more fog. Definitely more fog. Yeah, um... And then you have bad remasters like the Warcraft 3. God, I can never get over this. I can never... I can... I know I've gone over this like three times before in stream. I, I don't care. I will always be angry at this. It is unbelievable how badly they fucked up the Warcraft 3 Reforged. I hate Blizzard. I, I will never forgive them for what they did here. This was one of the best RTSs ever made. I, I can't believe it. Look at this horseshit, dude. Why did they ruin the fucking art style of the game? Why? Dude, we know he looks like a goofy little toy man. We love that. We like that. Yeah, now it just looks like fucking Rage Shadow Legends. Bro, what, Vosh? It looked like shit before? Walk into the ocean. You never played Warcraft 3. You never did. You have no idea what you're talking about, okay? You are as ignorant and as culturally destructive as a fucking colonial 19th century British man commenting snidely on African culture, okay? Die. I don't care about you. You're worse than that. The one on the left is better. Now say you love me. I love you. Sorry for yelling. All right, wait. It, it can only really be shown in like the in-game. I need a I need a comparison of like them just standing on a map. I I just feel like Warcraft Three Reforged basically just looks like Dota except with half the textures missing. Like that's what it looks like. Looks aren't everything. Well, this is a remaster, so in this case, looks are. Okay, this is what I mean right here. This is all I need to show you. Okay. The remaster was done by a like a fucking a, a, like a, a a demonic spell summoning imps from the retard dimension. Okay, so on the right you have the original Warcraft three from like twenty years ago. Everything is consistent. The saturation, the building, the grass, the dirt, all of it has this kind of cartoony, toyish, like you know, camp to it. Um, that that works. And then on the left. You have Rage Shadow Legends characters standing in front of, like, 
like Roblox trees and like a Roblox tower. What? Why would you? So the 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 guys here, like the characters in the original Warcraft Three, looked cartoony, and so did the world they were in. But now you have these guys who look like fucking Raid Shadow Legends characters, and this is what the tower looks like. A tower, I guess, is two times the height of a regular man, and the door is one half the height. These are the same distance from the camera. Why is the door this size when a regular footman is two times the height? I don't know. I never thought about that while looking at the goofy-ass original cartoon graphics, because everything here is just meant to be a sort of simplified representation of the, the, the battlefield. But now you have fucking, not realistic, but like semi-realistic, and like the stylization is down, and nothing looks right. Look at look at a footman in Warcraft Three. Look at the, in the original Warcraft Three. Look at that shield. That's all I need to see. Look at that shield. What a comfort. Oh my goodness. That right there. That is a footman. Now what am I looking at? What is this guy? He looks like he looks like a fucking warrior god king. Why the fuck does a regular ass footman have like gold gilded like? He, 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 like, look at him. What? He looks like a badass. But do you know what this guy sounds like in game? Oh, radio. Yes, sir. Hop to. Oh, I've got to kill some demons. Huh? Hey, yo, what? Hey, hey. Like, but for, yeah, he's dressed out like a fucking end game raid armor set from, from World of Warcraft or some shit. Look at this guy. This guy, this guy can say AO. Hey, yo, hey, ha, hu, ha. Look at him. He's just got a little, little, little bucket helm on. But then this guy over here, fucking Gladius, warrior of the god realm, or some shit. And then the trees! Look at the trees! It, like, honest to god, the remaster really looks like they just scattershotted artistic design. Like, they were just like, yeah, let's up the resolution, and, like, let's just hand this off to a bunch of different artists. And, like, just, yeah, just make it look new. So the people who were doing the character design made the guy look like this, and the guy who was doing the trees made it look like this. And I wish they'd stuck with this. This is Warcraft. Right here. Yeah, this tree, like, extend this tree to everything. That's fine. I can't believe what they did to this fucking game, man. Yeah, you can't even play OG Warcraft. They literally deleted the original Warcraft 3 from their, like, library. So you can only play the Reforged version now. It's this, it, the most insane shit in the universe. Like, it's unbelievable. Like, they, they were just like, yeah, fuck you. You have to play this shit. They, it's not even a proper remaster because they changed elements of the gameplay. Um, yeah, it's unbelievable. Empires 2 remasters go, though. Age of Empires 2 remasters is phenomenal. Yeah. Um, any fan-made content in Reforge now belongs to Blizzard automatically. Yeah, so Blizzard uh, didn't like the fact that people made Dota in the Warcraft 3 custom map engine and then went off to make, like, their own huge game genre with the MOBAs and everything. So they're like, yeah, actually, now we own the IP to shit you make in our creator engine. What the fuck? You remember when Blizzard used to be, like, the ally of the little guy who would, like, was super chill about people creating stuff and working within the framework they built in order to, like, build stuff and make cool experiences? Fucking nope. Modern Blizzard hates you and, wo and wants to kill and rape you. That's what modern fucking Blizzard wants. That's all they want. Oh, weird champ me. That's what they want. That's all they can think about. Well, they, yeah, they do rape their employees, so, you know, we already know that. That much has been confirmed. I just... I have so much anger pent up within me. I, I want to find another example. I'm just so I'm just so filled with rage. I just well, you really need to see comparisons that include the map, because it, the real problem is when the character design updates are contrasted against the way the background looks. 
There are just so many people making fun of that exact screenshot that I just showed you guys because it's so inexcusable. Like it's it's so it's just indefensible, you know. Um, yeah, this is this is what you guys get. We'll get to politics soon, okay? I just I'm I'm just I'm so. Man, did they, did they really just like reuse assets from Warcraft? Is this seriously what a shaman looks like when you zoom in in-game? Why the fuck is this like high fidelity graphical model of a shaman standing next to a 2004 era grass sprite texture? Like, does this not look insane to anyone else? There's nothing wrong with the art here in and of itself. It's just like, and, and this like super realistic dude is right in front of the shaman hut, which is the size of his body. It's like, oh yeah, this is where he came from. He just sort of rolled out of there, I guess. I, like, I would never care about this if it weren't for the graphic style dissonance. But art style can sell, like the, the degree of seriousness that you're supposed to, like, take with a game, right? Like, a game with ultra-realistic graphics that has contrivances like this, it's kind of weird. But if a game has cartoony graphics, I, it, I doesn't, it doesn't matter. The game is communicating to you that you shouldn't be paying attention to stuff like that because it's meant to be an iconographic representation rather than, like, an actual realistic depiction of what you're looking at, you know? Um, even StarCraft does this. Even in StarCraft II, the little space marines down there look like little blobs, little blobby dudes. So when they roll out of a barracks, which is still, by the way, like, much larger than they are, it, like, makes sense. Because they're, like, little blobby dudes, you know? Um, StarCraft 2 doesn't really go for a realistic, like, representation of what's going on. Why am I having such a hard time finding, like, screenshots? Are they hiding this from me? Is Blizzard scrubbing? I just want, like, a, a shot of a battle or something. Oh, God. Oh, I'm sorry. This is the last thing I'll show. All right, guys. Get ready for your remaster. All right. Get ready for it, okay? So this right here is the original Warcraft 3. It's some elven ruins above a waterfall. I know, it looks pretty nondescript, right? But everything here makes sense. Like... Aesthetically. Like, yeah, okay. Everything here looks fine. You know? Get ready for the remaster. Get ready for the eight trillion dollars they spent on R&D. Maybe, I assume. Oh. My God. Holy shit. Unbelievable. What's the opposite of a, a remaster or retard? <laughs> Um, like, yeah, it's, it's just, I'm like, but like, but like, but, but like, literally, like, what the fuck? Like this, it genuinely looks to me like the remaster equivalent of when people do uh, Minecraft texture mods, right? Like, guys, look at my high fidelity house. And then, like, they replace the grass pixels with, like, 64 pixel grass pixels or something. And then, like, look. and But that looks better. <laughs> that, that looks better. Look at it. it. Yeah, is this supposed to be water? It looks like goo. And what, like, you can't. You can't just change the texture without changing, like, this ruin right here only makes sense because we're looking at low fidelity graphics. Then you up the texture resolution and it's like, wait, what is that exactly? Just three bricks? Like three large bricks? What? Oh, God, and look at Arthas down there, looking like fucking blue steel. God, he looks like... <sighs> fucking e-boy Arthas over here. Sephiroth-looking ass. They had to make him look super handsome, I know, I know. 
They couldn't have just gone with the OG Arthas who looked like a goddamn fucking bear. A shaved bear with a wig. That's the Arthas I know and love. The, the Chad Arthas. Absolutely. And look at the little footman dudes. Look at them. There, there are some hut two footmen, you know? And then down here, the icons are less readable for the footmen. Really, though, like, look at that compared to this. I, I don't know. Like, doesn't it? Why are they showing their face through the armor? Why are they, like, cluttering the detail in this tiny little bit at the bottom where you're supposed to quickly identify what character you selected? Why have they cluttered detail by adding the face? There's a reason why they didn't show the face on the footman down here. Because doing so would have obfuscated, like, very basic... You're supposed to take... You're supposed to glance at this and immediately know what you're looking at. There's just a shadow to suggest the eyes. Apart from that, it, you, you see the bucket helm and that's it. But then it's like, what is this? They don't even look necessarily like humans, do they? They look like high elves to me. Why is there gold trim on the, on the edge of their helm visor? You see that, right? Doesn't, it, doesn't this look like something the high elves would wear? In, in Warcraft 3? Like when you meet them in, in what was it, Lorthron? What, whatever the fuck their place is, is called? There is gold on the OG. Is there? I guess there is. It just It's just like yellow here. It just looks cartoony here. When I see this gold, it just looks like like medieval helm or brass or something. But then when I look at the, I don't know. It just, I don't know. And then, and then the yellow of the face because they've tuned up the saturation in there. I don't know. I don't know. Dude, the real... Okay, last thing I'm showing. I swear to God, last thing. We're 45 minutes in. I have an interview in an hour 15. I swear to God, last thing. How are there 6,000 people watching this? Okay, wait. Swear to God. Swear to God. Swear to God. I swear to God. Um, maybe the best example um, of a remaster... It's not a remaster anymore because they're making big balance changes. But in terms of its graphics... Um, is, uh, is Diablo 2 Resurrected. Um, this is the real shit right here, okay? So, oh, you guys saw me play this on stream, but, like, if you hit the G key while you're playing this game, it switches between the original graphics and the new. I think it does this even for cutscenes. Here, wait, show me the gameplay, you loser. Okay, like, here's the... Okay, but do the switch. Do the switch. I'm gonna get mad. I'm gonna, I'm gonna morb. Hit the button. Hit the button. Hit the fucking button. Why would you not... Hit the, it's a graphics comparison. Hit the button. Why would you... What is the point? I swear to God. Okay. Don't make me morb. Don't make me morb. Okay, here we go. There we go. Holy shit. I wish they wouldn't cut so quickly. Okay, I let, they're doing, like, this super fancy, like, transition or whatever. The thing that makes the difference with Diablo 2 Remastered is that there's a consistent artistic style in the finished product. The, like, Diablo 2 Remastered looks like the Diablo 2 they wish they could have made back in 2001. It's a huge deal graphically, and they capture the art style and improve on it with modern graphical fidelity. The original Diablo 2 as you can see in the older stuff, is dark and grim. It's it's like there's blood everywhere. Like, you know that they would have gone full tilt if they had the graphical capability back for it 20 years ago, you know? And then you go to the fucking modern incarnation. It's like, yeah, this is what it would have looked like, you know? Everything looks amazing, obviously, and it's artistically consistent, and it's a meaningful upgrade on the original. Like, look at this. It's the same ass game. What? Look at that. I'm slowing it down. Way down. So you can appreciate. Whoa, look, graphics. Bazinga! Whoa! That's incredible. I love that. I love that more than anything. A good remaster... Nothing feels quite as good as playing a good remaster of a game you enjoyed when you were younger. You know?
And all of the changes feel like they were deliberate, you know? I feel like the ghosts, look at this. The ghosts of the original D2 artists are smiling from heaven. They're probably still alive um, at, when they look at this. You know what I mean? But like, right? You get what I mean, right? You can literally hit a button to switch between these two graphical styles. Um, God, that's so... Oh. How do you feel about the Wind Waker remaster? I've, I've never played Wind Waker, so I can't really say. Uh, remake. Okay, maybe I'm still going to sound like a huge jackass here. I, I still... Okay, remake on PS5 versus remaster PS4. I guess I just don't really care. I don't, I don't know. I Like, maybe it'll look better. I, I don't know. Maybe... This is definitely a huge difference, yeah. I just... I don't know. I just, Pathologic remaster? Um, well, the Pathologic remaster isn't really a r remaster. It's... The Pathologic 2 is... Do you, do you mean... Never mind. 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 Stop. 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 Stop, 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 I haven't even drank my fucking coffee. What? Why the fuck is this graphic gameplay comparison at a 50-50 like-dislike ratio? What? What here is disagreeable? Of all the music in the world, you chose meditation music to put in Diablo game? Oh, was it the music choice? Wait, it might have been the music choice. Wait. Oh, yeah, okay. Why? Well, I guess that does it then. Okay. For Diablo 2. Okay, yeah, okay. Really, that's the complaint? That's like that's like showing the difference between like Animal Crossing Harvest Moon and Animal Crossing whatever the fuck was on the Switch and playing like the Doom soundtrack over it. <laughs>